Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4 The Great War with me, Alf Bamega, in Austria-Hungary. So the year is 1919 and we are continuing the offensive against the Russians. At this point we are trying to close the gap here, locking these 12 divisions in there and then circling them. Even if that fails though, we will be able to shorten our line significantly by, what is it, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5, 5 provinces, that's actually pretty good. It's paid for by a retreat in the Lubun area, which I don't mind, we're gonna retake it afterwards, but uh, fingers crossed we need to finish this and win this, so let's hope that's gonna work. It should. Now we're also significantly uh, increasing our industrial capacity, our support equipment is great, infantry equipment is amazing, heavy artillery pieces, artillery as well, and we have enough tanks now to turn one of our uh, divisions into another Stostruppen division, but I don't think I want to do it now. Instead, I was thinking that we might go ahead and... Um, actually, how would that look? What if we did this? It would significantly increase the capacities of our units. Yeah. Okay, so you know what we're gonna do here? We're gonna edit this one. Wait. Edit this one. Duplicate it and call it the 1919 Stostruppen division. And this one is going to get an additional heavy tank and an additional heavy artillery division because they can do it. Um, breakthrough and soft attack is going to increase significantly, so let's hope that this is possible. And I'm going to put you up in there, like so. Can we change your symbol to the Artura? I can't. Okay, never mind. Just, it's fine. We're going to turn some of our divisions, probably the first one, into that and see how that's going to go. Okay, so far it should be going really well. Fortunately, the issue is... Ah, good, good, good. The issue was that we were amazing. We weren't able to push our units in there from the right direction, meaning that we got a lot of penalties this way once they get in there. Oh, dear God, these guys got 345. 371. Well, we're winning, though. So unless they do something drastic immediately, they are going to lose this area pretty quickly. These divisions won't be able to hold it for much longer. So good on us. Yep, 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 yep. Well, the speed at which they are reinforcing the line is not great at all. Okay, the mountain division got in there, but that is not an issue. 12.2... Oh, come on. Get them out of there. And these two won't do much. And I think they still do not realize the risk that they are facing here. The fact that we are stuck on the bridge again is just insane, but whatever floats our boat. They're gonna reinforce in time, unfortunately. But that one division, the only one that actually had 
full organization with all of the other ones is now gone. These guys are gonna fall and these ones are winning it out now. So in fact this is looking like not a chance to reinforce seven. And they got a ton of chances here and they're not doing it. Can we be hopeful? Can we be hopeful? Logistics Company 3. Ah, uh, they reinforced. But not too much a while. Okay, we're gonna go with Recon Company next. Because that one is gonna help us all. Unlock some motorized Recon Company. Okay, a white armored Recon Company. An armored Recon. Okay! So that's something that I am interested in seeing. Come on guys, these are these are a waste of air. Tear them to pieces. I wish we wouldn't be stuck on that bridge, otherwise we would have already won. Make sure they're getting quite a lot of casualties here. <laughs> okay, well, how's the Navy doing? I don't think we... Yeah, we need more destroyers here. That is something that we know we need to get. Now, if we look at you, your speed is 43.2 and you do not get, unfortunately, any... Because one thing that I was considering is building a specialized light cruiser because it can get an aircraft facility. Bring up and like this. Okay, remove everything else. Keep the engine. Remove you. Remove the armor. Actually, the armor could stay, but we would have surface detection of 27.5 and sub detection of 23. While well, our destroyer at this point is put cars has 50. Yeah, okay. Let's do a specialized spotting cruiser and put it on our ships. Okay, how's this looking now? For the love of God, come on, guys. I mean, I know they keep reinforcing their heavily heavily butchered everywhere. Oh, and this is amazing. This is amazing. The amount of fighting that we're doing here with them is just... Wait, no, not you. Okay, you're actually attacking. Come on! Get off the freaking bridge! Do we have to just kill them all? Okay, you know what I'm thinking? I think this is an ideal... Ideal time to relaunch that entire attack. Because it's going to give us more division on the front line and allow us to push them out decisively. Like so! Amazing. Yeah, you can throw in your two, three divisions. At this point, there's nothing they can do. Oh, hell. Awesome. 
So these guys are now going to get eliminated. Like, completely. And I'm gonna enjoy seeing that. Dang it, we lost more of Lublin. Well, I mean... Something, 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 something. We have to pay for what is our do, you know, and so on. So don't you worry, it's going to be fine. Yeah, we are there at any second now. Amazing. Okay, so what I want to do here next is I want to do the your 19 divisions. Yep, yeah. you guys. Are you the ones? Yeah, 22 divisions. Okay. Because the fact that we can get our divisions in there. Oh, god damn it! We already had it. Just go ahead and attack again. Okay, and now we got it. Now they won't break through. Which means the divisions that are not there already. Which is... Not you. Can get in here. And join this attack. making sure that we reinforce that and of course eliminate these 11 divisions which are that was 12 wasn't there and all human tanks and everything because I actually think one of you what if we change the 204th into the 1919? The only thing we would be missing is the Toad Artura and the Heavy Tanks, but that's fine. And here we go. Here we go. Our Stostrupen divisions are already in there. Doing God's work and destroying the enemy. How lovely is that? Force attack, huh? Oh, this is lovely. This is so lovely. 4.59, they, they are at 15. Nearly 15.3 million in losses. Blood transfusion kit, recovery rate 5% for our units. Okay, I don't think any of these are at this point good for us. 1922 seems to be too far away. This is too far away as well. Anti air, huh? Motorki shoots and the light tank. Is there a difference between you? 25. Nope, there is absolutely no difference. And that's what irks me that there is no difference here. But I think we might want to start preparing for the armored cars. Considering that the armored. Well, we're 
Yeah, okay, let's do it. Let's do the ROM file because I think that the Recon Company 3 is going to definitely give us the possibility to switch uh, to... I don't know if the Armored Recon... But the White Armored Recon, I think, would definitely be using cars. And there's two divisions here left. How amazing is that? And these two divisions are gone. Now they are heavily entrenched. <laughs> Their ambush tactic has been removed by us. And hopefully this province will fall to us and would like it to be our territory. Yes, it was. Okay. So that, def that query defines the line between us. And that is actually pretty good. So all of you guys... Okay, all of you guys are being under attack. So we are going to retreat here. And once you get in there, we're gonna start pushing. We're gonna clear out this area, get Kyoto under control, then retake Lublin and move on from there. And we can get another doctrine. We can advanced fire bases, tactical withdrawal for the defender. Artillery camps can be positioned close to the front line in fortified bases in order to give maximum possible support to advancing forces. So all infantry, motorized and mechanized get extra organization and recovery rate, extra organization of the tanks, extra recovery for the tanks. How are we doing on the air? Okay, we are producing more. Yep, we are now at seven factories. Some of our, I did minor changes there to the way how we are handling the situation. Okay. So you three are going over here. You two are going over here. And you three will be going in here. This one has three factories? Really? Oh, nice! Okay. Well, it gives me some possibilities here. Let's get two factories in there to strengthen our units. Oh, I paused it. Okay, never mind. Okay, we're doing good. Everything is being supplied. Oh yeah, we're getting a ton of everything. The artillery though is just the pain of our existence. It is just a pain. Okay, so you know what? The two extra factories we are gonna get here are gonna go to the artillery. I'm gonna do it like this, because we need more of those. Okay, how are you guys doing? 16 hours. I think it's wait to worth. Uh, it's worth to wait. Yeah, and the fact that they pushed us back in Lublin, I don't like that, but. They paid dearly for their transgression. Once we get artillery, we can start recruiting more units, and that is something that we really want here. Okay, and you know what? We need to distinguish the 204th Stostrupen division needs to have a different symbol, otherwise I'm gonna forget which ones they are. So let's put you over there like this. Because we need to make sure that uh, we know which are which. Okay, the attack to here is gonna happen. 
I mean, do we want to push towards Warsaw next? They got nine slots there. It's a big, mean and big area. And doesn't seem so that important. Okay, so all of you are in position. Here we go. And you guys are not doing all that great. But that is still fine. See so down here. <laughs> But yeah, the push is real. Uh, the push is real. It would actually be kind of fun to get the launch. But recovering these territories for yeah, for Germany would be probably good. But I don't want to overextend their line again. How are we doing on trains? 22. Okay, so that's good. That is good. Come on, guys, don't let them push you around like that. Don't let them push you around like that. Okay, and no divisions are in basic training. So let's just get a couple of these, say, four again to here. You guys don't need. You guys actually don't need any artillery at wow, you don't need any artillery at all. Uh and considering support equipment. Yeah. It's gonna be the transport vehicles which are going to be the, the joke here, but Yep, so this area is falling to us. Yeah, they pushed us almost all the way back from Dublin, but we are going to repaint them in kind. Pretty quickly, actually. If these guys jump in to reinforce, they're gonna be in a world of hurt. Five divisions defending. Can we get you in here? We will once we break their attack. Okay, a fight broke out. Oh, we lost. Holy hell, they actually got a ton of ships here. Yeah. Okay, guys, I think we might be too weak to do this one because there's too many of them. Okay. We still haven't gotten you in here, huh? Still keep swarming us with their bodies. But I mean, that's fine. I mean, this is not fine, but we really need to relieve them. Not even involved in this combat, come on. And you are not even involved. In this combat, either. So, how about we start using you how you were supposed to be used? And hello, I saw 400 there in attack. Ah, 325. 
And they got a better tactic, but yeah, this is hurting them more than it's hurting us. Looky, looky here. 93, 92. We're gonna join this fight the moment they, they break it off. Airfield expansion free. No, oh, free extra air bases. Okay. Let's go with fighter focus next. You guys can actually start attacking here because that's part of Bubuna as well. No, that's part of Kyoto as well, and we're gonna start moving into Bubuna next. Okay. The fact that we are able to hold this is just amazing. And how the hell are you not able to break them? <laughs> this is ridiculous. Come on, guys. You are able to break them. Holy hell. <laughs> okay, now that's better. Now that's better. I'm gonna build more factories here and I'm gonna enjoy them. How's the production increase go? Okay, where's that white? Artillery. Oh, here, here it is, 15. Okay, they're after the... Oh, wow! We really did it, didn't we? Okay, so we got the entirety of Kielce. Now we need to unfortunately go back to push for Dublin because the uh, situation there has gone a bit awry. But I do not mind. You guys are actually gonna go here. And after you get in there, you're gonna go in here. And from there, we are gonna start the attack again. After we conquer Kielce, next. The next is Varsha. Actually, there is a really nice river that will help us. At which point we can help finish off Lodge, maybe even go for some encirclement, and we're gonna help the Germans to recover their territory. Duplotsk might fall to us, but again, this needs to go first, because we'll need to hold the river. That will give us a tactical bonus. Can you already like attack now? They are attacking across the river, which is not great, and they're just exhausting themselves. Anyway, thank you very much for joining me, and I'll see you in the next episode. And holy hell, this is really good. And Greece, I I know about you. I need to come play with you again soon.